Hello, welcome to my channel. Today we're we go, we going to make a simple, basic white fry cabbage. I've cut a small head of cabbage that I cut and sliced and rinsed out. Okay, I have the ingredients here, which is only five ingredients, uh, six including the cabbage. I've got half a cup of oil to braise, and then I have, you can have your dry chilies per your taste. I have uh, three small dry chilies, and I have a half a teaspoon of mustard seed, and then I have a teaspoon of salt, and a teaspoon of brown sugar but you can add your salt according to your taste and in many households some people actually use tomatoes in their cabbage but uh, I prefer to do without tomatoes so it gives a nice fry finish okay I've got my uh, stove on and I'm using actually using an ordinary pot because the thicker base pot uh, melts away uh, the cabbage and don't allow it to fry properly. So there's my half a cup of oil. I'm using moderate heat. And then I'll break my dry chilies. But you can use dry chilies according to your uh, tetanus that you like. Then my mustard seed. Before your mustard seeds start to bust, I will add in there. Okay. Cabbage and herbs is actually the same. It looks quite a bit when braising, but reduce when cooking. That's the reason being you must be very careful with your salt. Okay, I'm gonna give it a good stir and thereafter reduce my heat. And I'll cover this to cook for about 15 minutes, but I'll keep watching as it cooks. Okay, 15 minutes has passed us and you can see how the cabbage has melted down and now I'm actually going to add in my salt but you can add salt pay to your taste and at this point if you like adding some potatoes you can add your potatoes in it will give a nice white fry cabbage with some lovely potatoes. Now I'm going to put my lid on and allow it to uh, cook for another 15 minutes till I see it coming to a fry and then I'll add in my sugar. Okay, half an hour has passed us and the cabbage is almost done and you can see how it is reduced to volume and this is my Actually, my secret ingredient is the brown sugar. To actually, the sugar actually allows it to become golden brown. And now, what I'm going to do, I'm going to increase my heat and Continue to stir till it's brown enough to be served. Okay, now the cabbage is fully done. You can see how lovely and brown it finished up.
and this is actually ready for serving. Here you go, your lovely fried uh, cabbage served with dal and a little bit of crushed chilies on the side. Not too much, just a little. And it goes very well with freshly made roti. In fact, this meal always used to be cooked once a week in our household because my family members used to love white fried cabbage. You must enjoy and thanks for watching.